Hey, come outside to film a video today because why not? It's pretty nice weather. Did my hair in plaits last night while it was wet, so it's gone a bit mad, but we're going with it, okay? Today I'm doing a video um, about my types of low blood sugars. Kind of the things that normally happen to me when my blood's low. See if anyone else has the same kind of situations. I did a little video about diabetes and how rubbish I am at it a few weeks ago. So if you haven't already seen that, especially if you're diabetic or even if you're not diabetic, you just want to hear me going on about how rubbish I am, go give that a look. I'll give it a link in the description. But here we go. I've got five. I've written them down on my phone. I've even thought of notes. I've got notes. I think my neighbor's listening to me. Hey, hey pals. So number one is my, what I'm going to call, caught it in time. I'm a legend. <laughs> <laughs> this is my blood low sugars where you know it's kind of going down and you've realized before it's got too low and you can just kind of sit there sipping on your Lucasade like yeah I've got this under control I mean my normal choice of quick sugar when my blood's low are orange Lucasade I don't know if other people have the same I know a lot of people use the tablets and stuff but this is my go-to so I just like you know have a little have a little swig have a little sip of my of my Lucasade and I feel like an absolute legend I'm not gonna lie because I'm like I've got this I've got this diabetes life under control number my phone's gone off that's really good so I don't know what number two is ah oh. number two this is my most annoying blood load. This is my too low to drive. So I'm 24, I drive. Um, obviously I don't know how old you guys are if you're diabetic on here watching. You might not be able to drive, but when you drive, you can't obviously drive with low blood sugars because that would not be great. It would be like driving drunk, let's be real, because we all know what it feels like. It's a bit mad. So I sometimes, if I'm on a rush, like going out to work or whatever, going out to meet friends, jump in my car, I always get in the car, check your blood, and then you have to do that kind of, oh, it's always such a letdown. Back into the house you go, drink a load of Lucasade, eat a load of food, and you can't drive for a while. So that that's the worst type of low, personally for me, I feel. Number three is what I'm gonna call the face in food. Now this is your kind of low. Now, I don't know about you guys, but if my blood's starting to go low and I'm thinking, oh, you know, food's going to be ready soon or I'm out in a restaurant I'm out the food's going to be here soon you think oh you know what I'm okay I can wait I can wait out and then it gets to a point your food turns up and you're you're a bit too low so then you're literally eating your food like and your face is literally in the food that that one I feel like sucks a bit because then you just waste your good meal that you've just had because you've literally just eaten it in a few seconds flat so that's your face in food low Number four is what I'm gonna call the I'm busy, down it quick. <laughs> These names aren't very inventive, you know. There's literally what it says on the tin. I'm busy, doing work, doing whatever. I'm gonna down a bottle of Lucasade in the quickest time possible. Now, I don't know about other diabetics, but I am a bit of a queen of downing a drink these days. Like, I can down any drink. And it is because I have had years and years of practice of downing a bottle of Lucasade in seconds flat. Like I'm talking, you drink it so fast that you don't come out for air so that you've literally sucked the whole bottle <laughs> and the bottle is like gone, there is nothing left in it, it's flat because you have literally sucked all the air out of it. That's your I'm busy, down it quick, low. And number five, my final, but by far, probably my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Always makes me laugh when this happens. Now this type of low for me normally happens in the middle of the night. It's when you wake up and your blood's low and obviously at that time your blood's got quite low. So it, it, when you, it normally happens when it gets pretty down, like right down. And it's what I like to call the eat the whole kitchen low blood sugars because I will, in the middle of the night, if my blood's low, traipse downstairs, crawl my way down there and I'm not even joking, eat everything in my path. <laughs> I will like down like four bottles of Lucasade, I'm telling you, and I will literally eat like every single thing I find in the cupboard. And then the next morning I'll wake up with just like random wrappers and empty bottles in my room. Now I know what people are thinking if you're like an amazing diabetic, 15 grams I'm pretty sure you're supposed to have. That all goes out the window when you're having 
and eat the whole kitchen though. In fact, I'm not going to lie, when does it not go out the window? <laughs> I'm not very good at the whole 15 grams rule. That's probably why I go, my blood's low, my blood's high, my blood's low, my blood's high. <laughs> it's not the best scenario to be in. So you know what, actually, I'm going to give myself the benefit of the doubt. Every now and then, I do it okay. But I tell you what, in the middle of the night, when you're eating the whole kitchen, that's gone. That's gone. And that's why you'll wake up the next morning, high blood sugars and all the evidence all scattered around all your empty packets so that's my five low blood sugars they're the five i could think of anyway so let me know in the comments or give me a like if you have those same blood lows and if you have an extra one to add to my list let me know because i might have that as well that is all for today it's just a quick little video a quick little okay guys thanks for watching if you enjoyed give it a like comment if you fancy subscribe if you like you know hashtag do what makes you happy it's my saying now i quite enjoyed making this video let me know if you want to see more diabetes themed videos um because i don't really talk about my diabetes much i feel like all my friends and everyone know that i'm diabetic but it's not a subject i speak about so it's quite nice to just have a bit of a chat about it you know and hopefully other diabetics and other people who just want to know might join in my, my chat so see you later guys let's see if i can see you later